Betty Jones was born in 1955 in Memphis, Tennessee. She raised five children and nine grandchildren. She was killed on December 26, 2015, when she answered the door to let Chicago police officers in to help her upstairs neighbor, who had called 911 to resolve a domestic dispute. The dispute was between Quintonio Laguerre, who had mental health issues, and his father. Both Quintonio and Betty were shot when the officers opened the door and Quintonio charged the police. Her daughter, Letitia Jones, was in the bathroom when the shooting occurred and came out to find her mother dying. Betty was 55 and was active in her church and community. Quintonio, who was 19, was studying electrical engineering at Northern Illinois University and had lived in foster care for many years. After Betty Jones died, her family filed a lawsuit with the city of Chicago and received a $16 million settlement. The trial against one of the officers in the case, Robert Rialmo, started last summer, and he was fired from the Chicago Police Department last October. Today, standing up for the rights of those who are marginalized and discriminated against in our communities and nation is more important than ever. Please support these organizations and learn more about the countless ways racism and bigotry affect this country.